This time, the step back and just the fade away. Just the amount of swag that is going on out in Tokyo. It's a global city that has a lot going on. They create their own styles. Shoes are meant to stand out on their own, and they're meant to be a representation of the people in those cities. You know, like I said, it's always one community. It's either all of us or none of us. Don't forget that. Much love. Put it out the coop at the lot. Told him for a 12 for a swap. Buzzing all the bells out the box. I just hit a lick with the box. Had to put the stick in the box. Mm. Pour up the whole damn seal. I'ma get lazy. I got the mojo deals. We been trapping like the A. What is going on guys? It's your boy XX the Don and I'm back at it with another review video today. And if you're new to this channel and you like sneakers, vlogs, challenges, and you just like good content, don't forget to subscribe and like this video. So today I got a very exciting review for you guys, okay? Let me just say this package was only made in Tokyo. That's how exclusive it is. I also looked online for a legit review and I really couldn't find anything. I just found videos, but no one went in depth. So I'm glad to be one of the first to review this sneaker right here. So without further ado, let's open up these bad boys up. Oh Lord. We got a Kyrie 6 Preheat Tokyo PE. So this shoe not only looks amazing, but it has a very unique backstory to it as well. If you didn't know, this is Kyrie Irving's sixth signature sneaker for the 2019-2020 season. On 11-11 of 2019, which is November 11th, Kyrie and Nike decided to make 11 different pairs of these sneakers right here and to spread them across the world. Each of the sneakers would have their own unique aesthetic dedicated to the place it was released at. So as you can see right here, we have the Tokyo pair and this kind of green, blue, pinkish, that resembles the nightlights of Tokyo. So I'm going to show you guys some photos of the other 10 cities that he released these sneakers at. These cities included New York, Miami, Houston, LA, Shanghai, Beijing, Gansu, Taipei, Manila, and Berlin. And obviously the one I have right here, which is my personal favorite, the Tokyo. So you may be thinking, how the hell did I get my hands on these Tokyos that were only exclusively released at Tokyo? No, it's not a sponsorship video, but yeah, I got mine at StockX. I know it'd sound a lot cooler if I had a plug in Tokyo that could just send me a pair for retail, but uh, hey, maybe in the future. All right, so now that I give you that unique backstory on the 11 cities Kyrie chose to release his sneakers at, let's go ahead and break this joint down. Let's go through the aesthetics and a little bit of technology too. Starting with the outsole, very similar to the Kyrie 5, we have that herringbone traction with the blue translucent running through the whole sole. Also a big space of green with a black dot resembling the all-seeing eye. And then we got Kyrie's signature right there in pink. Moving to the midsole, you can see right here, it looks like a foam material that is actually injected phylon. And then in green right here, that's kind of hard to read. It says Zoom Turbo. So yes, the Zoom Turbo made its comeback in the Kyrie 6s and this year you can feel it a lot more. So it seems like every year with the Kyries, the grip is getting higher and higher. You can see that right here. It's almost at the top of the shoe. Pretty crazy, look at that. There's grip right here on the side of the top of the shoe. That is obviously because Kyrie is very shifty and he maneuvers in all angles, so he needs that grip to stay locked in. Speaking about locked in, let's move to the forefoot where we got this pink strap right here. Got some nice velcro. A lot of people actually complained about this saying that the velcro would ruin the laces. So if the velcro ruining the laces are a big concern to you, you don't really need to worry about that. Just make sure the laces are tucked in before you know, you strap it up. Almost forgot, but on the strap they also have the Tokyo Tower right there. Pretty awesome detail. And on the opposite pair, if you cannot read this, it says Tokyo. So you see the laces here are pink. They are not swappable. It would have been awesome if they added some turquoise or blue laces, but it's whatever. So you can see right here at the top of the tongue, they added some leather and you can see Kyrie signature logo in neon green. And right underneath that leather, we have this pink silk, nice plush material, extra smooth. Also, we got that uh, message from Kyrie to, you know, stay hungry. On the other pair, pretty cool. You always got to stay hungry, but at the same time, you got to stay uh, humble. You see that right there. On the side of the shoe, we got my favorite part right here. It's like a holographic design. All the eyes right here, 
and then you twist it a little you see the city of uh, Tokyo pretty cool so you see that coloring that's the city of Tokyo on the other side too you can see look at that so that was their main concept with the shoe for it to resemble the city which it was dedicated to lastly we got the heel which feels like some rubber material they all seeing eye again Illuminati confirmed but all jokes aside you can see it's a nice pink that contrasts nicely into this deep blue okay people so that pretty much wraps up the video this was my favorite pair out of the 11 shoes that Kyrie released it's Tokyo you know they're always on top of their swag they're always catching on to trends before everyone else does so you know your boy had to hop on the wave before I sign out a very common question asked is the sizing I would say go half a size up these fit very very snug i've also hooped in this sneaker and will continue to hoop in this sneaker so if you want a performance review let me know as well you can also go check out my last two videos right here and if you made it this deep i have a question for y'all do you guys enjoy the professional review you know when i go in depth into the technology and all that or do you prefer the vlog style where i take you in my life and you know you go on a journey with your boy let me know in the comment section it's been your boy xx the don i hope you all have a great day a great night great evening or afternoon whatever time zone you're in i hope you enjoy yourself peace hey.